Good morning YouTube. This is a video response to Goat Hollow's um, recent video on his own Faraday cage that he purchased. They have spent a little bit more, probably don't have as much space, but this is the way that I'm protecting some of the electronics I consider to be vital to survival situation emergency. This is a traditional ammo can I purchased from a local army surplus store. But uh, it's actually not an ammo can. It was originally used as a monocular night vision device. Um, a storage can. Um, uh, no, it's quite convenient. I'm going to pick it up carry it with you. I like the fact that it's got a handle built into it so I could actually cart it anywhere I needed to go. By the way, spent, it was uh, listed for about 13 bucks. I think I got it for about half of that, 7 or so, somewhere in there. But... Nice thing about this box, and uh, what made me think, oh, that'd be a good for, you know, protecting electronics, has this padding, keeps it off of the metal. Um, as I said originally, I think it was probably intended to be a Faraday type cage for some of the vital electronics that they use in the battlefield. But I keep uh, just some handheld radios in here. I keep uh, all my rechargeable batteries, even though it's not necessary to keep rechargeable batteries in here. They're virtually unaffected by EMP. Um, Got my solar charger. Certainly don't want to take any chances in an emergency situation of this not working due to, you know, electromagnetic pulse well, that's coming up on the solar maximum here in a couple of years. Keep uh, this little world band radio in here. Got this for I think about twelve, fourteen dollars. Battery powered. Last but not least. I've got a 250 gig hard drive that I download all my computers, laptops, and other information, you know, videos, um, uh, pictures, just about everything else that, you know, electronically stored right now from computers. I want to have a, you know, a digital copy that, you know, I can use as a backup and probably need to back up a lot more things that I've got right now to it. But anyway, keep that in here just to keep it safe. I've got an old laptop that I have stored in in my, my larger safe um, so I could access it you know in case of an emergency but just uh, thought I would share some ideas that I'm doing and um, you know please respond see tell me what you guys are doing and uh, rate love to see your comments